Hey, how's it going? And today we're taking a quick look at how you can duplicate one of your projects. So let's say you've created a game and you've got a lot of assets in there and you want to create a new version of that game, rename it as a different project and upload that like a version two of the same game, but with maybe some different content. Let me show you how you do that. So we come in here and we go to new project, continue to load. And I'm just going to take a blank island project for this. And I'm going to call this, or actually I'm going to call it first game V2. And I'll go create. And now it's going to create this blank first game. And here it is right here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to close out of this. And I'm going to open the project that I'd like to duplicate into here. So I'm going to go new project. And the one I want to duplicate is this one. So I'm going to go ahead and open that. It just takes a minute. And then once it's gone over, what I'm going to look, I'm going to search for is my, the level in my game here. So here is my level. So I'm going to right click this and go asset actions and migrate. And now what I'm going to do is I want to migrate everything. And I want to find that new verse project that I just made called verse game two and I want to go to select the content folder and go select and then it's going to migrate everything over to that new project folder and fortunately I don't get any errors now it's very important at this stage just to exit out of this so we're going to exit out and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into verse and then I'm going to go ahead and reopen the editor and then once this reopens I'm going to go and open up my duplicated project which is here and open this up now there's going to be two levels in this game now you see this I have two levels this is my original level and this is the level that I imported in so what I have to do is come here, double click this, and it's loaded in that whole level. It looks like no problems here. But what I need to do is come here where it says game feature data and click this and change this to my verse game level now. And this is the level that I brought in. So go ahead and save. Now this should be saved as my duplicate level. So as far as I can tell, everything looks like everything looks like it looks like it came in just fine. Now the one warning I do have to give you about this is that I've noticed if there's verse code in in your game, if you have a verse device, it can cause a lot of problems and so this method doesn't work if you have verse code and I'm sorting through how that transfer process would work. And I'm just thinking out loud right now because I haven't tested it. So this works fine if you don't have any verse code in your game. But the problem is, is that the code won't recompile. At some stage in your game, before you start adding a lot of verse code, make the duplicate then with all your assets and then write your verse code at the end because I, there's complications. And that makes sense because the verse code is referencing specific objects in your game and if those objects aren't there, the code can't compile. And if the code can't compile, you can't successfully transfer the profile over. That's what happened the last time I did it. So this method works as long as you don't have any verse code. So what I would say is once you build up your assets in your environment and have all your devices in the game, then duplicate it at that level and then write your code. And then I think you could bring your, you know, copy and paste the code over later and compile it specifically to your game. But the code won't compile if it was created in another project. I don't think it will. But I'll post an update about that particular issue. So anyway, take care. Have a great day, and I'll talk to you next time.